All right, our next caller is Cindy from South Carolina. Hey, Cindy, how can we help you? Hi, guys. Uh, thanks for having me on. Yeah, no problem. So I found your podcast about four months ago, uh, which was right after I signed up for a very expensive online coach. Mm. Um, I'm 47 years old, and uh, I had been sedentary about a year before I hired the coach. I've sort of had an on-again, off-again relationship with exercise, uh, often getting injured and derailed um, each time I start a new program. Um, and uh, the coach put me on a reverse diet. And what um, I found kind of surprising about the programming for the workouts, it seems contrary to a lot of the advice I hear you guys give. So I thought I would run it by you. Um, the programming is very high in volume, um, often eight exercises or so for larger body parts, four sets of each, and a ton of supersetting of the same body part. So I found the first few months I was progressing and then I've sort of just gotten to this point of fatigue <laughs> where I just feel like um, my muscles are getting overused. So I'm dropping in the weight on most exercises. I'm afraid I'm going to end up injured and I'm not sure if it's the best use of my time in the gym when I'm reverse dieting. So I just wanted to throw that out to Thank you Thank God for intuition. Huh? Yeah. yeah. 32 sets of muscle group. Yes. Holy shit. Yeah, you, I uh so fire your coach. I I mean I'm 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 being yeah. se totally serious. They are totally overdoing it and are it, they're, they're one of those online coaches whose approach is They're on they're overdoing it for a highly trained athlete. Yeah, so much I would, less somebody who's been on and off exercise and is trying to get back into it and then is also trying to reverse diet. It's kind of a counterproductive to be well, training that much volume while also trying to speed your metabolism Well, it's up. not mm. if you don't know what you're doing because then what, the ver th what they're doing, this is probably the mentality, is I'm bumping your calories. We need to burn those off, you know, type of deal. Yeah. So uh, is there a reason why you didn't hire a one-on-one -on -one trainer? Do you prefer the, the virtual aspect of the online coach? Honestly, I was just looking at social media and I saw the beautiful bodies of all these bodybuilders. And so I was like, I'm going to go for the best of the best mm. and hire this bodybuilding team oh. as a lifestyle client. Yeah. But yeah, I kind of have been shocked by the workout programming. It's just not at all what yeah. I expected. Okay, here, here's what I'm going to do. I don't know if this person has any that more space. Formula never works. Yeah, I don't know if this person that. has any more space available, but if you want to work with someone online, uh, Marlon Shamel, good friend of ours. He's actually in our... YouTube videos. I hope, hopefully, he's got some space available. I believe his Instagram is Shamel Fitness. I think, uh, but we'll send you his. Yeah, his he's his, awesome. His, I always. He's I, really, really good. Work with him. He knows what he's doing. If you want to go online, if you want to hire someone in person, hire a trainer who has a lot of experience training everyday regular people. Uh, bodybuilding coaches and trainers are terrible trainers and coaches for for everyday regular people. They're good if you want to compete in a bodybuilding show. Uh, typically, even then, sometimes they're they're pretty bad. But I, you're doing way too much. Cindy, are you locked in? Did you pay, prepay this person? Yeah, so I'm stuck with six months. So I have another two months to go. Um, yeah, and not only is it really high volume, the recommended rests are so short, like 30 to 45 seconds. Like it's exhausting. And I'm in the gym two, two and a half hours Ooh. each workout, five times a week. So it's a lot. This is what we're going to do. So we'll just, we're just going to chalk this up as a, as, as a loss financially, but we'll try and make up for it on our end. So we're going to send you over maps and a bulk. That's the type of protocol that you should be following. Start in pre phase, by the way. I want you to do pre phase for about six. Uh, six weeks. That's right. Doug is going to give you access to our free private forum, which by the way, uh, the trainer that Sal is recommending is also in there. So you can actually communicate with him and us while you're in there. So we can probably help you through some of this. Um, but for the, the audience that's listening right now too, I, <laughs> if you're, if the trainer you hire virtually or online doesn't listen to mind pump, that should be your first red flag. That's what I just, that's why I tell people going forward now, like there's your first way of screening is do they subscribe to the channel? Listen to the content that we're, especially if you are a, a the everyday person, like the competitive body. It sounds like you literally got a cookie cutter plan that they were also putting the steroided 250 pound bodybuilder on. Yeah. You are running the same program that he is running right now, which could not be further from the worst thing that you should be doing right now for where you're currently at. So pre-phase maps anabolic is the type of training protocol you should be doing. The reverse dieting aspect is correct. I don't know if they're doing it correctly or not, but that is what we would want to be doing right now. But the volume of training is making that counterproductive, and so we need to scale back on that tremendously. Yeah, li literally, if you hired me, I would have started you with two days a week of resistance training, full body, and we would have done three sets per body part 
in those two workouts. Yeah, not 32. No, no. So <laughs> huge difference here. Yeah, they went they went totally crazy. So I, I, I would ask for my money back. You're probably not going to get it back. Maybe you can threaten them and say, hey, I, I was on Mind Pump, and you yeah. sure you don't want them to shout out your name for being yeah, a shitty coach yeah. <laughs> or something like that? But We'll do it. But yeah, you've already spent the money, so you could chalk it up. Hire a good coach. Uh, but if you don't, if you just want to save a little money, start with MAPS Anabolic Prephase. That's great advice from Adam. How'd you, sure. how'd you find the show, Cindy? I was just searching for fitness um, podcasts. I felt like something was wrong with my program. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I just started listening to you guys and I fell in love with you. And I, you know, now I listen every day. I've got my husband hooked and everybody I can talk to, I tell about the show. Awesome. Well, yeah, hopefully right. we can help you navigate through this. I think the, the forum provides tremendous value. We're going to get you in there for free. MAPS Anabolic is the type of training protocol you should be on and then you in the forum you feel free to ask questions and there's lots of other professionals besides just us in there and so hopefully we can coach you through this and then make you not feel so bad about the wasted money on this other coach awesome thanks so much thanks Thank Cindy. You, Cindy. Oh, man. holy shit you know what's you know what sucks? To, hey, she's got she's on the joe donnelly workout Dude. i was gonna say that you <laughs> beat me to it no, no, <laughs> you know what's funny is that when when there's someone that does a good job you typically, because sometimes trainers get a bad reputation, and it's because it's not because most trainers are that bad. There's a lot of bad trainers. It's because when they're bad, boy, do they cause a lot of damage. Yeah, like 32 sets per body, about 47 years old, short rest yeah. periods. It, she's had many yeah. injuries. Sure, there's she said. some people that can do that, but yeah, it's not even close to being a demographic. Yeah. No, <laughs> not no. even close, bro. That's a lot for the steroided 250 pound bodybuilder. Uh, that's yeah, great. Dude. <laughs> it's Insane. crazy. Insane.